World Health Day has been celebrated annually on April 7th since 1950 as recommended by the World Health Organization and provides the opportunity for a global focus on public health issues which are affecting all strata of society. Every year, an appropriate theme is selected to highlight a priority area in health, and this year, the focus is on urbanization and health. Over the years, it has been recognized that urban communities are growing rapidly, and it has become quite clear that urbanization is an irreversible trend that is here to stay. According to the World Health Organization, in 2007, the world's population living in cities surpassed 50% for the first time in history, and it is estimated that by 2050, 7 out of every 10 persons will be city dwellers. The theme, Urbanization and Health, was selected for World Health Day in recognition of the fact that urbanization does have an effect on the individual as well as our collective health. Urbanization is associated with many health challenges related to water, the environment, violence and injury, non-communicable diseases, and their modifiable risk factors like tobacco use and abuse, unhealthy diets, physical inactivity, the overuse of alcohol, and the risks associated with disease outbreaks. The objectives of World Health Day 2010 include to raise awareness about the challenges associated with urbanization and the pressing need to address them through urban planning and intersectoral action. To promote action around the health risks that have the greatest impact on urbanization. To demonstrate the need for government and city officials to make responsible action for health in urban settings and thus create a better quality of life for citizens. The focus on urbanization and health with the campaign A Thousand Cities, A Thousand Lives events will be organized worldwide during the week of 7th to 11th April 2010. Cities are being called upon to open up streets for health activities. Stories of urban health champions will be gathered to illustrate what people are doing to improve health in their cities. The global goals of the campaign are Thousand Cities To open up public spaces to health, whether it is activities in parks, town hall meetings, cleanup campaigns, or closing of portions of streets to motorized vehicles. A Thousand Lives to collect 1,000 stories of urban health champions who have taken action and had a significant impact on health in their cities. This theme is in keeping with the Ministry of Health's focus on preventing and managing chronic non-communicable diseases such as high blood pressure, diabetes, obesity, heart disease, cancer, and accidents and injuries. In Dominica, over 20% of our population live in the city of Roseau, and therefore it is imperative that the city council plays a role in the preservation of the health of its citizens. This year, the Roseau City Council is the lead agency in organizing an activity to mark the day. On Sunday, April 11th, the Ministry of Health, together with the Roseau City Council, will host a thousand people family city walk beginning at Dame Eugenia Charles Boulevard to the Newtown Savannah. At the Savannah, mass physical activity focusing on family-oriented sports, including football and rounders, will be held. It is expected that beyond that day, there will be a sustained commitment to incorporate health in urban public policy. It is therefore imperative that you take action now in order to ensure our growing cities are healthy cities. With this in mind, we encourage all citizens in and around Roseau to be part of this grand 1,000 people family city walk and let's make the commitment to continue to be physically active at least three times per week for 30 minutes each time. Physical activity, a necessary option to remain in healthy. It's not just about living, but quality of life.
Thank you.